The world's two largest aircraft makers have urged the U.S. government to delay the rollout of new 5G mobile phone services. In a letter, two Boeing and Airbus executives warned that the new technology could have a huge negative impact on the aviation industry. There had been concerns previously that the new fifth-generation technology might interfere with aircraft electronics. The two giant American telecommunications companies, AT&T and Verizon, are preparing to launch fifth-generation services on January 5. The interference of 5G could negatively affect the ability to operate aircraft safely, U.S. officials from Boeing and Airbus, Dave Callan and Jeffrey Nettle, said in a joint letter to Transportation Secretary Pete Buttigieg. The letter was based on research prepared by the Airlines for America group, which stated that if the Federal Aviation Administration's laws regarding the fifth generation were applied in 2019, about 345,000 passenger flights and 5,400 cargo flights would have suffered delays, diversions, or complete cancellations. The aviation industry and the Federal Aviation Administration have expressed concern that 5G technology could interfere with sensitive devices in aircraft, such as wireless altimeters. Airbus said in a statement, Airbus and Boeing have collaborated with others in the U.S. aviation industry to understand the impact of 5G and its interference with wireless altimeters, and a proposal regarding air safety to overcome any potential risks has been submitted to the U.S. Department of Transportation for discussion. Earlier this month, the Federal Aviation Administration issued guidelines warning of interference from 5G technology and the potential for flight paths to change, and added that it would provide additional information before January 5. In November, AT&T and Verizon postponed the commercial rollout of C-Wave wireless service by a month to January 5, and took precautions to reduce the potential for interference. Aviation groups said the measures were not enough, while Boeing and Airbus said they had presented an alternative proposal to reduce radio transmissions around airports and other sensitive areas. United Airlines CEO Scott Kirby said last week that FAA guidelines for 5G would ban wireless altimeters at 40 of the major U.S. airports. The Trade Association for the Wireless Communications Industry in the United States, known as CTIA, has said that 5G networks are secure accusing the aviation sector of raising